Welcome to another video. So first up we're going to say if dev underscore C++. Then next up we're going to say extern then capital C between the thing is they call it in English. Then we're going to say in dev. Okay my friends remember this is when you're using another C code within C++. That's why we're doing it this way. Do not break your head about it. Just follow this video and we'll see. Next up we do the u int 8 underscore t temperature sense read. I know the spelling my friends. Trust me. It is very bad but I did not develop this. Then we say if dev underscore underscore c plus plus. Then we end the curly. Okay my friends yes there needs another curly up there. Okay. Well then we're going to say end if. Remember to always use the sharp when you are referring to extern C. Okay. Now we're going to say serial.begin to start up our serial monitor. I suggest using a very high baud rate for this one. Okay. Well then next up we're going to say serial.print and then we want to print our temperature. I guess I know how to spell it but I'm just going to use the abbreviation for it right now. Okay my friends. Next up let's go and let's say serial.print and then we print temperature.senseRead. No 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 temperature underscore sense underscore read. Okay. This will just print it in degrees Fahrenheit. Now let's say serial.print and then the F. Okay. Next up we're going to do the same but we are going to convert it to temperature in Celsius. Otherwise my friends in Russia won't know the temperature. To do this we minus 32 and we divide by 1.8. Okay my friends. Next up let's say serial.println. This way everything will be printed neatly. Okay. And then we print the C. Okay. Please leave spaces be after your F and your C. Uh, just to make your code look a lot neater and it will look everything in the serial monitor will look a lot neater you will see my friends and then put in a small delay otherwise everything will be going too fast i really hope this compiles my friends because this is some some really quick coding i did over here now just to wait about two lifetimes and then it uh, it should compile Okay my friends, let's open up the serial monitor after it is finishing writing. Okay, so now if you can see it's printing in Fahrenheit and in degrees Celsius constantly. And now my friends, if we open the serial plotter, we can see up here, there is the line for degrees Fahrenheit. It is running smoothly and constantly and below over here, it is the one for degrees Celsius. Okay my friends, I hope you really enjoyed this video, also note the colors above over there, this is very nice, this way we will not fry our chips, okay my friends, I will see you in the next video.